Hey, what's up everybody? It's VR Gamer Dude here, and today we are gonna go back into the dungeons of Carnage Chronicles once again. That's right. So last week Daniel over at Nordic Trolls tweeted me that the game had had a huge update, and man, I love this game the first time around, but let me tell you, after playing this the last couple of nights with the updated content, totally different game. So Come along with me now and check out that content update in Carnage Chronicles. Okay, so here we are back in Carnage Chronicles. And, you know, I gotta say, I played it over the last couple of nights, and I am so glad they threw that tweet at me to tell me to take a look at this again, because they have significantly changed the game uh, from the last time I played it. I mean, it's, it's absolutely just... This is now one of my favorite RPGs in VR, I swear to God. So, all right, uh, we're going to go ahead and just start a new game here, and uh, that way you guys can pick it up from the beginning. A lot of the significant changes that they made were in the beginning of the game. Uh, uh, so, let's go. Okay. So, you know, right here, it's already different. It's, it, you know, you start the new game and it asks you, do you want to choose the path of the archer or the warrior? Um, I, I, you know, I don't know. I like the warrior, but I really like having the ranged attack of the bow and arrow. They chose the, the path of the archer. Artist of wounds, plague of arrows, death from afar. That's right. Plague of arrows. Dig it. So... Okay, let's journey deeper into the cave here. And then you come up to the uh, the path of easy, hard, and impossible. So obviously I'm not gonna go easy. I'm definitely not gonna go impossible. So um, I think I will go hard. The path ahead coiled like a serpent, ready to spring. No quarter asked, no quarter given. Now, I would be remiss if I didn't mention, yeah, if you notice so far, free movement, that's right, you've got it. Now, you've also got teleport if you want, and, and I love it when games mix that together and give us the option to either free move, free turn, or teleport. And, you know, it, I, I, if, if they can put it in this and they can put it in some of the other games I've pre played recently, I, I don't know why they can't just put it in every game. That's all I'm going to say. So, all right, it's time to awaken. Let's go. Awaken. <gasps> <laughs> it's Gimli. No, just kidding. I mean, I'm digging the music. I mean, all right, already, I know, blah, blah, blah. Just stop gushing over it. But I, I, I love a good Morgan RPG game like this. Abyss. And this is so far Paragon scratching that itch tremendously The children well. of his coming. 5,000 years they slumbered in oblivion. Abandoned, but not forgotten. At last, he would awaken them. At last, the grand designs of his arcane works would reach fruition. Okay. Man, the depth in that looks fantastic. No, I might hear some whispering. Yes, some armor. Now, another thing that they completely revamped in the game was the inventory system. So now you can call up your belt and uh, you can select your inventory changes and item changes right from here. And it is extremely intuitive and easy to do. Now, the only thing that I do feel that, that feels a little strange in this is, is that I'm on my Oculus Touch controller and I can't just use my index finger and point and click. Um, I've actually got to, you know, align my finger with it until it lights up and then pull the trigger. So, uh, you know, developers might want to take note of that. Hey, you know, I've got the uh, gestural controls here. I'd, I'd really like to use them. So, enough said. All right. Let's go. No, 
what the oh yeah I forgot this is cool what's up man what's up little dude that is the the detail on these little character models is is just really well done outstanding okay let's move on Yeah, get my sword. Alright, equip that, and yeah, there we go. And, yes, I think that's my bow. <laughs> All right, now I've got both my melee and my ranged weapon and and just you know really really cool way You can just switch between them You actually put them in the hands that you want them to go to in your inventory and then you just press the a or uh, X button and it'll switch right over to that weapon. So very cool. All right, let's move farther into the dungeon here Actually, it's not a dungeon. This is kind of like a tutorial. Well, we really haven't even gotten to the game yet. Would you get it into your thick skull? He is dead. The Magi know nothing, and that witch who calls herself a priestess is just toying with your mind. Why you spend so much time with her, I cannot fathom. That's so you know cool. as well as so I. So this is a, a completely is a new part that I had not seen is when that I played what this, this originally. Is about? You so should spend less time here. Check this out. What devil is this? A construct? Are you hostile? I carry nothing of value but cleanse my cogs. You cleanse look your exquisite. What? Come closer, let me have a look. Who made you? Uh, who made you? Because man, the character model here is insane. So, uh, you know, I they said that they had made some additions to the game and and you know i thought oh cool you know maybe some extra character class or some new weapons or a you know new dungeon to go explore but adding stuff like this and story elements i mean th this is what's making it really come together for me so all right let's go ahead and uh have a conversation voice, it booms inside my mind like an echo from a thousand-year-old whisper. You are a murk wraith, not a nuzzle. I never thought I'd see the day, <laughs> woken by the gentle touch of the arcane, no doubt. The Magi of the Circle will be pleased to see you. Fits well with their deluded prophecies. <laughs> too cool it's like i'm in the freaking dark crystal here i mean this is insane so all right what well, um i am i don't remember memory anything, a little man. barren after five thousand years of slumber um five thousand years that explains why you appear before me uh, who are you i'm known as the collector yes imagination is a bit flimsy in these parts my true name is known only to my masters, whom, in their finite wisdom, has sent me here. Mm -hmm. Ink 
visit it? Magia. They will certainly not approve of that, but I like it. I will give you I like it a lot. But first, you will do something for me. Okay. Think of it as a soft introduction back in our ranks. Think of it as like extortion, but I'm sure. Um, no, I'm not going to be greedy. Yes. Perhaps I should have started with that. It is no mere coincidence that you are here, at this place, at this time. My masters are also your masters. Ain't nobody my master, man. Yeah. My dear Merkwraith, you were built for servitude. Your maker is not among us anymore, but your service has just begun. I don't know what the Magi have in store for you, but whatever it is, it will surely tax you to the limits of your magic. The task I have for you will pale in comparison. Do this for me, and I will tell you everything there is to know. Alright, tell me more. I only require a few plain trinkets. Useless to your eyes, I'm sure, but I see value in treasures that others leave to the elements. Here, give me your journal. I will add a sketch of what you're looking for. You can find them in an old, abandoned fortification. I own... It's not far. Beyond this door, a short distance away, you'll find a rippled shimmer. The imp will open the way. <laughs> yeah. It's a portal, a gate, if you like. As a stargate? And I trust, once you see it, it will spark embers in your mind. Okay. The gate is a rift in the fabric of cosmos, contained and governed by the laws of magic. The circle maintained dozens across the hall of Terra Lynn, and you have seen them before, eons ago. If you say so, man. Fear not. All the law you need to know is buried deep within you. I will find a way to fill the void in your mind. Okay. So, sorry guys, I know that was a little long, but it, it, just so cool. I mean, just standing here talking to this dude, having one of these types of interactive conversations in, in, in a VR title like this is just absolutely great. So, all right, let's go ahead and uh, go Good. with some of the mission here. But I'm gonna get to some before fighting. you leave, take this key. <laughs> it is for a room in my study. You pass the door on your way to the portal. Wait for me there if I'm not here when you come back from your quest. Or use it as you please. I have other business to attend to. Uh, sure you do. But I will be back. And hopefully, you'll have something for me. Pride out of the hands of dead villains on the way. So basically, bitch, better have my money. Okay. Um, yeah, I, I get you. Oh, yes. I could tell you to be mindful of the creatures that dwell there, but... Uh, if even half the legends about you are true, I doubt they will be able to do you much No, harm. they're all true, man. Okay, so, wow. This just keeps going on and on and on and on. So, I'm, I think I'm just going to go ahead and end the conversation branch here Excellent. so we can get on to some, like, you know, fighting. Do you want my staff to find your backside again? Uh, Do yeah, as you're told man. and don't talk back. Yeah, you. Off. Until next time. Um, all right, yeah, bro. Uh, thanks. Um... So, okay. Looks like little dude opened the door for us. So, uh, let's go ahead and get some weapons here. I love how the coins float and rotate in midair. That is so cool. Okay, so, Shimmer's Room. Looks like it's wanting me to go here. 
Oh, nope, I don't have what that needs. Ha <laughs> ha! Love the feeling of that bow. Oh, missed. There we go. Okay. Okay, interesting. This is where you used to start the game. So this is the old starting place. We finally got back to that. So. Perfect. Okay, so only one way we can go. Yeah, okay, so this is the level that I played last time I made a video of this game. But I'm gonna play it again because it was really cool. The entrance gaped like a mouth, and the vibrant scale mountains rose behind it like a serpentine spine. Darkness waited, hungry, patient. Eager. Glorious secret laved in, like a gleaming lure Here we go. dangling over a ravening wall. Oh, you butters, you do not shoot a guy in the door. You duck. Oh, I split those arrows. That's awesome. Oh, right there. Uh, there's that shimmery pool of water that got me last time. Okay, let's get some health here. Get some cash. Puppy dog. Oh, you had a fish. how the enemies actually duck your attacks. Oh man, I can't 
hit this guy to save my life. There we go. Got you. More y'all around? Oh. No, right to the dome. Yeah, you didn't like that, did you? to steal my cheese, son. Oh yeah, I'm tired of this. Let's go. Yeah, that's what you get. Oh, that's right, I forgot you can flip the blades around for blocking. That's really cool. Like in this place. Have I looted everything? Yeah, there we have it. So, you know, you also got some light puzzle elements. I mean, obviously, um, just as I said the first time I did this, not too much puzzle to this one. It's just more manipulation of a world object. <laughs> you are not eating me. Yeah, there we go. 
and checkpoint. Okay, so, you know, just to make the video not be like really, really long, I think we're gonna go ahead and cap it here, but damn, I hear those bees, wait. Oh, bees, these things suck. Nice shot. Hit one. Oh, now he's pissed off. Haha, <laughs> long shot. There you go. Hit him, come on. this as good a place as any to cap this but now yeah, let's go ahead and restart so we then get rid of that buzzing so all right so yeah you know I, I think this makes it a good place to stop this one but man let me tell you if you have carnage chronicles and you haven't played it in a while uh man update it check this out they have really outdone themselves with this latest game update um, and if you don't have Carnage Chronicles, I'm going to go ahead and throw a link down in the description so you can grab a copy of this. Because, man, let me tell you what, if you, if you like dungeon crawlers, if you like RPGs, this is a must-have for your library. I, I, hands down. So, thank you guys for throwing that tweet my way to tell me to check this out. You guys are nailing it. But for me, that's going to do it. This is VR Gamer Dude. Signing off, y'all. Peace.